What's up, everyone? Welcome to the January 21st edition of FanDuel Tournament Plays presented by Prize Picks. I'm your host, Adam Scherer. You can find me on Twitter at ShipMyMoneyDFS. And as a reminder, you can get one free month of Awesomeo Plus Platinum when you sign up and make a deposit at Prize Picks. Be sure to use the code Awesomeo to receive a 100% first deposit bonus up to $100. We have a big 11 game slate today, so we're still waiting on a lot of injury news and a lot of information is going to change throughout the day. So, as always, be sure be sure to, to tune in. Easy for me to say. Be sure to tune in to the deeper dive from 5 p.m. Eastern until 6 p.m. Eastern and live before lock from 6 until 7. For now, though, we're going to take a look at five of the top tournament options on FanDuel as things stand right now. Starting at number five, Jason Tatum, projected for 5% ownership with a 10% chance of being in the optimal lineup. He's $9,400 with small forward and power forward eligibility. Tatum is always difficult to prioritize when Jalen Brown is active because Brown cuts into Tatum's production and vice versa on average. But Tatum's still a very talented player that is certainly capable of putting up a monster game from time to time. And, you know, anytime that Brown sort of takes a back seat and Tatum is playing well is shooting well and and takes over he has a good matchup tonight against portland as well a very poor team defensively so it sets up really nicely for tatum at low ownership as a way to uh, be contrarian in tournaments and not give up any upside number four stephen curry projected for four percent ownership with a 12 percent chance of being in the optimal lineup he's only 9800 dollars coming off of a big game last night no clay thompson for the warriors tonight so uh, a little bit more usage available for curry as well he has a good matchup there's plenty of blowout risk uh in tonight's game but curry's facing a fast-paced houston team that doesn't defend well you could certainly see curry just absolutely torch this team and as long as houston can keep it somewhat competitive then you're talking mid 30s in minutes for curry as well at a pretty cheap price tag number three will barton shooting guard small forward eligible at fifty seven hundred dollars he's currently projected for nine percent ownership with a 13 percent chance of being in the optimal lineup barton's not the easiest guy to trust when nikola Jokic is active because Jokic just takes on such a big role in terms of playmaking and scoring and rebounding. But if you if you can get 32 to 36 minutes, uh, depending on how he's playing, from Barton at shooting guard slash small forward, uh, he's still around a 0.9 to 0.95 fantasy point per minute guy at, at reasonable ownership. Number two, Nikola Jokic, same team as Barton, uh, center only, of course. Projected for 14% ownership, 16% chance of being in the optimal lineup. He's $11,900, so... On a slate like this, it's difficult to get to Jokic, and that keeps the ownership down. But he also just gives you access to basically an entirely different level of production than any other player on the slate. You only have to go back one game to see a game where he scored 90 fantasy points, give or take. Uh, yeah, there was overtime in that game, but the point remains, uh, Jokic is the best point-per-minute fantasy producer in the league. He's likely to play 34 minutes or so if tonight's game is competitive, and he projects as the highest uh scorer on the slate so uh anytime you can get to him at relatively low ownership it becomes a pretty interesting idea and the number one bobby portis power forward and center eligibility which is really nice you don't have to lock him into that center position where the opportunity cost is higher he's only sixty three hundred dollars he's likely to play 32 minutes or so uh tonight he's averaged about 1.15 to 1.2 fantasy points per minute this season and just looks like a pretty cheap option. He's getting some ownership at 20%, but we have him with a 22% chance of being in the optimal lineup. So still going a bit on their own tonight. So to recap, the top five tournament options on FanDuel as things stand right now. Number five, Jason Tatum. Number four, Stephen Curry. Number three, Will Barton. Number two, Nikola Jokic. And number one, Bobby Portis.